for the last 30 years, New York City Health and Hospital's Jacoby Medical Center in the Bronx has had the largest hyperbaric chamber in New York City. Let's go check it out. Forces oxygen or the breathing gas into tissues throughout the body where normally it wouldn't reach. We in the hospital mm -hmm. give patients oxygen all the time, but inside the chamber it's different because with the pressure gradient, we can get oxygen to different places in the body. Over the last three decades, the chamber has been used to treat patients with severe smoke inhalation, like those who suffered from the Twin Parks fire. We did treat them. We do treat victims of fire, uh, victims of carbon dioxide poisoning, um, scuba divers with diving injuries in the bends, mm -hmm. gas embolisms, certain things emergently. This hyperbaric chamber is also used to treat those who suffer from carbon monoxide poisoning caused by hookah, which is prominent in nightclubs. Sometimes people um, are found down at the hookah lounge or smoke shortly after smoking hookah. And really the, the fastest treatment and way to reverse that and reverse it to the effects that can have long-term effects is to bring them into the hyperbaric chamber. Jacoby also works closely with the U.S. Navy, Coast Guard, and Air Force to treat service members who were injured during a diving operation. Any diver, we're Divers Alert Network chamber. Um, so we are really the go-to for the tri-state area and beyond. Other than smoke inhalation, Jacoby Medical Center treats patients with the hyperbaric chamber if they are approved by the Undersea and Medical Hyperbaric Society. Patients looking for outpatient care can also get a referral from their doctor to treat some of the following conditions. Things like um, diabetic foot ulcers, non-healing problem wounds, uh, radiation issues, failed skin grafts or flaps, and certain things. For more information and to potentially schedule an appointment, Follow the link below. Reporting for BronxNet, Brittany Schuyler-Albain.